What's going on guys and welcome to Project Ozone. Now, I did do a few little things between episodes. Um, I have no freaking clue what's going on with this mob spawner. I'm thinking about taking it away because they're just glitching out of it. And I'm not sure. I've looked through the quest book. Um, I've got two quests completed. But I can't find anything that says to do with monsters other than this thing and all the needs is an enderman so at that point I'm going to be looking for one I did what I tried to did between episodes was I went into the nether because some reason every time I go into the nether when I'm recording it lags the hell out of my computer now I did this one which was kill four blazes four cubes and four huge spiders so I'll collect the reward for that one and it beheaded three wither schools to take the schools because let's just grab that because we need that to do a wither boss now i'm not sure if you have to be in the nether to do the wither boss um i have got the wither schools on there let me just uh let me just chuck these away because we don't want them uh, what I was thinking about doing was with these wither schools just pop them in there if at any point where I need to use them I'll come and grab them I'll use them but I don't see me using them anytime soon I'm thinking of getting rid of this because I did create in between episodes just like create that things over there in between episodes which took a lot of stuff to do I'm just thinking it's too much and it's in the way and it's annoying and they're just glitching out left right and center and i don't want to be having something that's just glitching here there and everywhere it looks rotten and i'm not sure if i have a bowl to get rid of some of this crap you have some arrows i don't know and let's <laughs> i really want to get rid of it i really do i think i might just go ahead and get rid of it it's good to have all these but I don't see any benefit from it over there. Maybe it going kaboom when I get near it. Let me just kill everything in it then. Well, I leveled up my sword. Come on, I'll go. Making enough noise as it is. Can't be that many of you now. Really? Oh no, I didn't get any arrows. So I mean, and it's just all that noise that was coming from it, it was just annoying. And it was annoying me just standing there doing that. But I think I'm just going to get rid of it. Um, I'm looking to try and get some way of getting into the mint. So in between episodes, that will be taken away. Uh, let's see to a hopper to a pulverizer that's doing nothing which goes into this and gets me everything I need right um let's look at a quest we can do now a diamond furnace would be a good one to look at doing we need four diamonds and some glass now do we have four diamonds uh, any of these chests have any diamonds in I think if I was to have diamonds, it'd be in this chest. I might use them all. There's a gold furnace is there. There's one diamond. 
I might have a look through every single chest I've got and see if I can find a diamond or any diamonds somewhere because I've got her. I mean, this was the main chest that's got one diamond. It's got to be a way of getting them. You've got what? You've got nothing. Nothing in that chest. Nope, no diamond. No diamond. No diamond. Definitely no diamond. I should. I, I don't get why I got a dirt chest. I was just dumb. So we have no diamond. Uh, which brings me to how am I supposed to get this diamond? Where's it come from? No. Elven trade, you can put in some diamond to get a diamond. Why? <coughs> gravel, right, so it's gravel. Which means, we need a lot of gravel. 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 And nothing, right, so. This can see now. This is why I like Project Ozone because you can do that. Boom. Right, so that goes into here. All the stuff I just got out of there can go into this here. <coughs> do this. You, my friend, can go there. You can go there. Get the iron there. We don't. We need diamond. That's what we need. So that's what we're going for. Why I've got all this crap, I have no idea. Right, put a juicer down there. Out there. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, so. There's a diamond. Thank you. Now, let's see. That's to get rid of the diamond furnace done. What is this? A furnace upgrade. Now, what do we need? A how do we make that? So that's another diamond. So that's five diamonds. That's redstone. Iron and coal. Do we have enough redstone to make two blocks? That's what we're going to have to check. It's a chest with four gold. And... Right. So we need five diamonds. Four gold. Let's see. That's Electrum, that's Ferrous, your gold, so we need one, two, three, four, four gold, we're definitely going to need iron, that's an, everything you do in this game needs to get iron, oh we do have some arrows, we have some iron dust, so that's good, um, we have glass, we needed glass, do I have stone, yes I've got stone, I needed that, uh, there's more gravel there, which is good just in case. What else did it say I needed? Right, um, chest, so I'm gonna need wood. Yep, I'm gonna need a lot of wood. And it was redstone, so I'm looking for redstone and a lot of wood. So, redstone, sure, we've got 17. There, see if we get any more from somewhere. Redstone comes from sieving dust, so that's not too bad. Now we need this. In fact, could be better. Right, let's see. Uh, do we have any redstone in here? I'm finding gravel all over the place, but I'm not finding what I need. Do I have any redstone anywhere? There's gotta be some somewhere. I can't just have 17 because then I can't make what I need to make. There's gotta be some somewhere. Apparently not. Apparently we don't have redstone. Um, Getting redstone's not gonna be that hard. Just gotta wait for the sieve to be free. Mm. Oh, that's gonna take a while. Uh, did we get the box? 
Ah, there we go. It must have dropped into the hopper. Right. Gravel, gravel, gravel. Keep smashing up the gravel and we will go do the dust ourselves. So this chest is going to be a craftsman chest. A crafty man's chest. So everything I need is going in this chest. And then we're going to come back to it to see if we've got what we need. So where did I put that dust? I need the dust that I had, which I think I put in here, which is 60 dust. And now we're going to try and get some redstone. Because we're in there, you need a redstone apparently, because we don't have any. So yeah, it's a bit of a grindy one. I'm just trying to think of what I can do to get certain stuff. I mean... I want to try and get a hold of where I am on this one because I go back and forth in this one. I do so much in between episodes. It's just annoying. Um, and I don't even sleep on this one. So there's no bed or anything like that. That's why it says in the top day three because I just I don't see a point in moving the night time along because I'm on a sky block. Um, I can't see the rain, can't hear the rain, so I don't have to sleep it away. So it doesn't bother me that. So yeah, there's no sleeping on this. Which is quite fun, because you can get a lot more work done. And uh, not worry about, oh, sleep away the night, you know what I mean. Hopefully we get some redstone from this, where we can make two redstone blocks. I think that's what we needed. Uh, which is 18 redstone. Yeah, 18 redstone plus an extra redstone for some that we needed to build. Once we get that out of the way, hopefully the we need five diamonds, but we need four for a separate quest. So yeah, hopefully we can get all that done, and then we can have four diamonds left over, and we can do it from there. Because we have got a lot of gravel going into the Armike sieve, so that's not too bad. We just need to get a lot more stuff done. Um, let's see, what have we got going on? This gr oh, this is why, I, primarily, I could have done with, let me just, yeah, there we go. Primarily, I could have done with um, two automatic sieves, because then I could have done gravel in one and dust in another, or sand in one and dust in another, and it would just make it so easy, so I don't have to do it this way. Because this is annoying. It is all might because I've got my phone resting on my mouse. Another reason why I want to get rid of that big mob spawner is because it kills my frames like no tomorrow. I know I'm wrong, my computer is good. Really good computer. But you put something like a mob spawn in here, some like any computer, it, unless your computer is like, what, say about six grand computer, it's going to have a lot of frame lag. Frame rate's something you can't deal with a lot, and there's only certain ways of doing it. And Minecraft's not like a heavy graphical game, um, depending on like the texture pack you have. It's not not heavily heavily graph graphical game in any way sorts or shape or form but it is graphical enough to say well i'm gonna fuck about your frame rate and stuff like that uh also another thing was uh, basically when it comes down to my channel i don't like i said in certain videos is if you hear me swear i do apologize for it it's not meant um, I don't mean to swear all the time it's just it does pop out of my mouth in certain situations it's just like it pops out it's like ah I didn't mean to say that but then I can't take it back and I'm not gonna just try cut it out of a video because I accidentally sweared you know it isn't something I do all the time it's I don't do it in my videos I very rarely swear in a video uh, if any of you have watched my videos, you'll understand that. I do apologize if it, if it offends anyone. But sometimes you can't control it. It just happens. 
and I do apologize for that anyone who watches who doesn't like it it isn't something that I do on purpose it's just it happens and I do apologize with that being said we've got most of the things we need now because we've got the redstone block I think that was all we needed what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plop this away because you're in the way of my crafting table now there's that this is that I believe it's raining outside as well that's some reason just distracted me <laughs> I have no reason to think why it's distracted me that it's raining outside but it did do you have any diamonds right so we'll put them there unfortunately it's not found me any more diamonds yet but hopefully it will because I did put three stacks of gravel into that thing so hopefully it will find me some diamonds now what we need to do is we need to look at what it is it wants the first thing that needs a diamond is iron ingots around a diamond and some redstone so we put the diamond there we put the redstone there and then we get the iron ingots and we go either way like that and then we get this BFESU which is a better furnace energy storage unit so we've got that and then we look at this thing we need two redstone blocks and we need a lot more iron so because we need a lot more iron is there any in the smellery there's a lot in the smellery which is good where am I going where am I going which means I can just go like this and hopefully that works see the one other reason is is this is blocking a lot of stuff so I think if I get rid of that then it's a nice big pathway to go to there I might build one at a later date like if you've been what if you watch my Agarian Skies uh, the mob grinder on Agarian Skies is the type of mob grinder I want in this one but I've not really it's weird because I can't seem to get the mob grinder I want in Agarian Skies to work in this one because I always make a mess up. Oh, there's a floaty island. I might have to go to that floaty island. It's a slime island, I'm pretty sure it is. But it gives us an extra island. So if I can, like, bridge out to towards that, it'd be a good place to be. Um, Let's see what it said it would. Right. Three coal, two redstone. Right. Do we have any coal in here? He coley ole ole. Oh, you're flint. I do have some, however. I did see it before. In here. Thank you. I'll take that off your hands. Get me some more diamond. Yeah, we still got some decent amount of gravel in there. We might have to put some more in. I don't know. Um why I'm doing this actually. One, two, three. We have three automatic hammers that we got out of a quest book, which is actually quite interesting because that's what we're needing to. This is literally what we need to build on Agarian Skies, and we've got three of them on this. We've upgraded them. There you go. And they can go hammer off and do their job. Um, I'm making a lot of noise. We can do this, which I think, if my memory serves me well, is this way and it's that boom and that is our better furnace electrical heat source right now we need two crafting tables a chest and four iron or four things so if we get the chest out the way because they look like a christmas present because it is the back end of christmas which i hope you all had a decent christmas mine was fulfilled with a lot of family which was very very nice to be around I was very fortunate to have that so that's nice uh, bingo and we got the upgrade package now is this again it's a chest around four glass and four stone now we need another chest we go like this and we put you in the middle and now the glass, it's good job we had six, and it means we don't run out. We boss you around like that, and it's bingo, done. 
and that should make quest complete now what's a, what's a color upgrade these two can go away because I don't want them I'll take this one that's that quest done next we need two diamond let's just bob all this in there that's something we're gonna need put you there color upgrade I have no idea what a color upgrade's for <clears throat> I wonder if that's their upgrades that go into the furnace I mean can I get the is it, I call it a devil's furnace but it's not I just don't like it's like a hell furnace I think it is right and we open up the reward bag and we get a better furnaces <laughs> really I've just created them and you give me them two diamond please give me diamonds it's not that hard right so we can't we haven't got the diamonds yet hopefully they'll come along I know what we wanted to do put you in there and you in there right so <clears throat> we can't get that we can't get that and then what's that one what are you you're an extreme furnace an extreme furnace would be good to have and I can get all this done but we can get treated wood. We need what? 64 treated wood planks. Have we got 64 planks of wood? Yes. Uh, creosote. Do we have any of that? Oh, we have quite a lot of creosote oil. And coal coke. I like coal coke because it just burns forever. Uh, bottle. Bottle, bottle, bottle. We don't need you. Three bottles. go pop get three creosote and I'm pretty sure all you have to do for treated wood is put the planks with the creosote is that how you do it like that like that something to do with creosote oil and all that that's why I built the finger right yeah there we go dum dum see and you go round pop one two three twenty four and got my bottles back and this is why I like using the bottles over a bucket bing 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 we might have enough to actually do the whole quest as well which is even better because we only need three two more bottles after this there we go yep two more bottles Leave you there. Pop, pop. Yeah, sweet. So we've got the two more bottles we needed. Which is even better. And bing, bing. Done, done. 64 treated wood. Claim reward. Now, I don't know if any of you have been watching the whole series or episodes that I've been doing. Um, basically the whole reason that I won't open the chance cubes or the isocohedrons is because it can go boom and then your whole base is gone it can wipe out your whole base in one tick and I'm not doing that but <clears throat> all that being said is we're gaining power from that which is even better for me uh, but either way I'm going to leave it there because we've had an eventful episode with egg completed a good amount of quests got a lot more to come uh, so thanks for watching don't forget hit that like button smash that subscribe button I've been Fiore you're all amazing and I shall see you next time